Welcome back, my friends, to my little Spanish adventure. As you might know, I am uh, presently in Andorra. Today will be a little rest day. I will just go for a fairly short day ride, uh, going south, and return back to Andorra to explore the area around here and the city in the evening. I received this uh, message from uh, Carlos, one of my uh, Spanish fr friends down in the uh, Alicante area. He wrote to me, if you are in Andorra, you cannot leave without visiting the Pic Negre. It goes up through Natureland. 2037 meters altitude. And here is a roller coaster <laughs> that looks fantastic. Okay. I heard it's the longest uh, alpine, uh, not roller coaster, but sledge that goes down. I think it's 5.3 kilometers, which is quite hefty. It's going to be good fun, but uh, I stay on the bike today and continue down the slopes on the other side towards the border of Spain. All aboard! And I was in good company. Furious, yeah, why not? That's probably a proper uh, sign on, on a car with 700 plus horsepower. So I followed these guys for a little while. Uh, I had spotted a road uh, on the GPS that I wanted to ride. It looks really good. And it seems like these supercar guys were on the same track, actually. Dream Ride Pyrenees, it said on the sticker. They were from uh, Holland and uh, Belgium. I think most of them were from Holland. I think they're right here. I'm pretty sure they will race past in a second or so. C462. It's definitely the top 10 roads I've been riding. It's absolutely fab fabulous. I've been on more scenic roads, but in terms of motorcycle riding, fun, curvy roads, it's superb. And the surface is magic. You just stick there, no bumps. It's uh, it's fantastic and the density of, of the curves is, is so high I will speed up the, <coughs> the video in a second and <laughs> to show you a bit longer stretch of this road so you get a picture for yourself of what you can expect, expect if you go there but don't miss it I mean if you are in the neighborhood don't miss C462 just south of Andorra in Spain you keep riding I say between 40 and 100 kilometers per hour on second and third gear all the time. So perfectly fun and not too dangerous either. Uh, it's pretty wide the whole road, wide enough to, to be safe, that's for sure.
What a road! <laughs> That was amazing! What a race road! They really knew where to go, these guys. In the Lambos and Porches and Mercies or whatever it was. That was some ride up here. And look at the surface of the road. Absolutely perfect. Phew! Well, not long after Gosol, I decided to turn back and do the same track back to Andorra to redo the, the 4621 once more. And also in the other direction is a totally different road. It was also lunchtime, so perfect to stop in, in Gosol, which was um, a pretty little village actually. Uh, a few bikers there, a nice square and a good place for lunch in other words.